I guess I should have waited on, um, disconnect those lines. It's okay. Reconnect it again. Uh oh! <laughs> Boy, it's a good thing! <laughs> that was perfect timing. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Oh man! Oh, perfect, we're good. That's funny. I like the little, little icon. Boop, 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 boop. Now I know what to look for. It just like stops, blinks red. And you're welcome. Yes, thank you so much, Chaos. Chaos and Chaos in Fintium has, uh, has prevented chaos from occurring. Why is this unreachable, man? I can start over. Power. We'll make out of steel this time. Now it works. Bugs. Oh, you know, this is at a nine. Am I really, am I going to win this fight? I'm not going to win this fight, guys. I was, uh... I think this room is going to just stay super hot. The steam has definitely helped propagate the, uh, the heat, though. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> the steam has just taken I mean and there's this too of course the regolith here is just like just allowing all this stuff to uh, to transfer over man space was stupid hot I know it just once something gets high it just stays hot what are my dudes doing I'm so focused oh here we go Donis steel 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 there we go Power. Well, that's for that battery, but now we need this. Let's get a fucking bill. Let's do it. Thank you. Oh, I missed it. Uh, so let's, let's go ahead and make this like a one. Because it's not working. Uh, it was a valiant effort, but I think the biggest problem is that we're allowing heat to transfer from here to there. We create an atmosphere, we're allowing the heat to transfer from all the items inside to everything outside. But we did bring down the, 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 the temperature. Uh, no, not really. Uh, I, I still firmly believe that this will work. I really, truly do. Okay, so that thing's steel. Good. Now we can go ahead and snip snip. Over here, well, let's wait till it's... Oh, no, it's fine. There. Now that should send a signal for this. Once it gets to, let's just say, like, five. Did I get it? Uh, good, it's all... Okay, now it's all separate. That power is going to take forever to get used. Even though, really? Wow. I mean, that's, that's only 2020 watts, Jules. Let's, uh, let's get some, some power drainage going. Oh, interstellar ice. Cool. Uh, wart seed. Ooh, ice, carbon dioxide. Man, by the time we're gonna have all of space explored before we actually go to go out there. Oh, I never did get my my full base. Um, let me do it now. My full base shot here. Yeah, this should drain the battery. I think. <clears throat> When is this a save cry? This is a this is a lot of heat transfer. I think I think this is truly where the uh, where the majority of this pain is coming from. Uh, let's see, yeah, yeah. I should. Well, we'll see what this does. If it's it's disabled, but that's close. Okay, here we go. It's closing. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Now it's starting to get used. How funny. So look at that. Once it locks on, it starts killing the battery. You see this? It was just cruising before, not really using that much power. So it, has a, it basically has a passive mode where it uses low, like a low power mode. Um, oh god, is that gonna... Oh, it's closed. Okay, so good. Now what happens if it runs out of power? Let's open the doors, right? Power's... Oh my god, why would it do that? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> That's a terrible failsafe. It's going to unhook that. There we go. No, close. No, 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 no. Close, 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 close. Oh, my God. <sighs> hey, guys, let's get some coal. Insufficient resources, coal. Fuck you. You're... No. 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 
That's wrong. Incorrect. Let's see, uh, consumable ore. Coal. Coal. Coal, 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 coal. Coal. Okay. Screen doors. Man, screen doors. That's some good, that's some good lulls right there, guys. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Let's make another, another, uh, case here. For, and we'll make it out of, uh, mafic rock. Thermally reactive. And then we'll put coal in there. This is stupid. I don't understand why it's, oh. Whatever. So that's gonna go out into space, but how hot is it getting? Oh, that's the problem. It's never gonna cool. Yeah, it doesn't matter how hot it gets, it's just never gonna cool. Yeah. Hmm. Let me see. So, uh, we'll make this coal, so... Coal, I think coal is the way to go, but we just have to figure out a way to, to cool this thing. Um, maybe like a small room full of hydrogen or something. Let me see, consumable ore. And this is gonna be... Da -da -da, coal. I'll make this like a seven. <sighs> yeah, it's just gonna stay there. How how long? What's his melting point? Uh, status over here, five twenty-seven. Okay, so it'll take it a while to get there. I think. We'll see. We'll let it run out. Here we go. It's gonna drain that battery. It's gonna run this thing. Yeah. It would take a very long time for this to get too hot uh, and start overheating, like a very long time. So, yeah, it does, definitely does not want my excess heat. So, a room about this size full of hydrogen would probably just solve it. I think that would probably be all we need. And then if we need to cycle the hydrogen out, we could do that. Um, we have tons of hydrogen to use. Oh, but then we're going to have uh, carbon dioxide build up. It's, it's, oh man. Maybe we just keep on remaking these things. <laughs> Can thermal tiles pull heat away from it? No. So, uh, there's no heat transfer, like zero heat transfer here. Um, but it's not, it's not taking heat. It's not, there's no heat transfer. Like this is not transferring heat over to this. It'll transfer heat, I guess, if it buries it, but that's it though. But this is not like this, by, when it's sitting by itself, it's not taking any heat. I mean, look, this is 300 degrees, you would think, but it's not. Um... So, I think that what we should do is create a separate room and make a couple of these. I'm not going to worry about keeping it cool right now. Right now, I'm just going to worry about, let me see. Let's go ahead and create a separation here. What we'll do is uh, we'll actually pull it all the way down. So, we'll cancel that. And then we're going to deconstruct this. And all that stuff will get moved over there. Thank God the rest of the base is... And before I say anything, let me go look. Good. Good. Temperature... Good. Temperature, pretty good. Negative 7.7. That's pretty good. Uh, negative 221. Very good. Oxygen, 30 degree oxygen. Good. Everything's good. Alright. Nothing's overloading. Nothing's backed up. Nothing is backed up. How's this doing down here? Am I getting steel made? How much steel do I have? Wait, am I getting any made? Oh no, because what? It's probably, uh, oh, lime. Uh, the Rock Crusher. <laughs> so, wait, what is this? He, he is rising up when it is in standby. I didn't see a tick. Uh. Let me go take a look. Iron. See, Rock Crusher. I said I wasn't going to turn this on, but I'm going to do it anyways. Just to make some lime out of eggshell and whatever. So, we're going to enable building. And they'll work on that at their leisure. Let's see. 116.9 still. That's where it was when I left it just a few minutes ago, and I'm running at 10x speed. So yeah, it's not it's not taking any. There's no exchange. So what we'll do is we'll create another room off to the side here, and and the reason why I'm creating a separate one uh, over here is specifically so that it doesn't touch the 
I don't wait, wait, will he transfer through the ladders? I didn't think about that. Um, hmm. Well, we might have to kill the ladders later. Uh, but yeah, because I do think that part of the reason why this room has gotten so hot is not just because the elements that's inside of it is it does great. Uh, it is point plus point one per tick. I'm looking at the Kelvin, by the way. Um, because that's a much more finite, like, you know. Yeah, no, I don't think it is. We're good, we're good. I just wanted to check. I wasn't trying to, like, you know, be a dick or anything, but I just wanted to check because if it is getting hotter, then I want to know for sure. So, yeah, what we'll do is we'll build a, um... Rufo's regular farming gif in Discord. It did shrink, but... <laughs> I'll check I'll check it in a bit. I'll check it in a bit. Uh yeah, we've now broken that. But yeah, you say the ladders do uh they do exchange heat. Oh, no they don't. They won't because uh it's it's exposed to space. So yeah, no, this is fine. This won't transfer heat from here to there. Uh but the rock will transfer. Right? Yeah, because oh wait, why would the rock transfer? This is getting hotter. Magic heat. For reals. Hmm. Wow, this bin is just packed with heat. This one is just chilling. What? That's wrong. <laughs> Still 207 degrees. David Blaine heat. I'm still going to go ahead and keep building my stuff the way I said I was going to build it, and we'll come back and figure out why certain things are transferring and others are not, but I think that this will be fine, so. We may eventually have to fill this and uh, put a bunch of crap in it, like uh, oxygen or something. <clears throat> Tanner Rose, what up? Uh, let me see. One, two, three. I probably just like maybe, maybe like just keep them space. Ah, we keep them next to each other. It's not gonna hurt anything. Uh, three of them. <laughs> Should we get the batteries in here too? Nah, nah, nah. I think probably just. A couple of these and just getting them with three. And then uh, we'll get a heavy watt wire to come out the top. No? Okay. Oh, actually, I'll put it right here. So heavy watt wire go out the top and we'll be able to connect a bunch of things through heavy watt wire or transformer or something. Wire. Dinner time. What time is it? Oh, 4 30. Okay. Nothing about the yeah. I, I don't think it's something. I, I have a feeling that it's something they actually don't know how to address uh, because it's something they don't know what the problem is. But the only thing I can think of is that they just they just don't know really. And you know, I mean, they're they're only human. Uh, but I do, I just I still wish that they would do something, uh, like just address it <laughs> because it's been around since like the beginning of time, man. Like it's always been like this. Okay, so all this is working great. Um, we have just enough power, maybe, to close the doors, but if we, if worst comes to worst, we'll just connect over here. Actually, you know, we'll do that now. Just, let's not wait for the worst. We'll just, there we go. And then we'll go ahead and dismantle this. Oh god. Oh no, right when I dragged. Okay, stop. Let me see if I drew boxes anywhere else in the world. Okay, I think we're good. <sighs> I know, rip base. I can't believe that actually happened. I've heard of that happening from you guys, actually. I just didn't think it would happen to me. <laughs> I, I was just like, ah, oh, you know, it happens to some people. It did not me. No, 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 no. Incorrect. Okay, this will be good. Keep this area going. 
So the longer you go, the more... What is it? The only issue I know about the long saves is that both screenshot taken plus data per cycle is saved for the next cycle, so the day-to-day -day colony info continues. So the longer you go, you more uh, more text info in the background data sheet inflates. Yeah, uh, there was a mod that doesn't work anymore, unfortunately, but it would... So 113 degrees? Uh, but it would... Uh, take the... What was... Oh, shit. That's a mess. I guess it would clean things up, like it would clean up some of that, uh, some of that nonsense that would, uh, show up ever on day-to-day -to, -day to make the file a little bit smoother, but it just doesn't work. Pinch of Pepper Farm remembers- <laughs> Pinch of Pepper Farm. Oh, overheat damage! Oh, snap. Overheat damage. What is it made out of iron? Okay. What is it, uh, it's probably from this. It's from this, actually. It's this fucking room. I can't build anything up here, it's gonna get hot. So let's go ahead and, uh, deconstruct it. So there is heat transfer from device to device. Like from, uh, yeah, from unit to unit there, but... But not here? Not the ladders, huh? Still 113. Oh yeah, the battery heats itself up too, yeah, t never mind, duh. Uh, so yeah, it's not transfer, thank you for pointing that out. The battery itself heated up. This is going to be a problem eventually. Like, this is all, yeah. <laughs> oh, you know, if there was an item-to-item -item transfer, like, like you know, uh, building to building, then this room would be super hot because of this. Future Mike, yeah. The automation wires and power transfer heat and batteries and heat up. I know I think the batteries themselves heat up, just the same way the coal generators do. The batteries they they function and they generate their own heat and they continue to heat themselves up. Um, so shit. Let me see then. I don't want to wire this together. I was gonna put a transformer up here somewhere, but if I put a transformer out here, then it's gonna overheat. Boy, the joys of working with space. What? Uh, you can put drywall in a one-tile thick line and drip petrol on top of it with cooling water pipes going through it to keep heat in a vacuum off your items. That sounds insane. <sighs> okay, well we got this part done. Let's, uh, let's do some sweeping, guys. Clean this mess up. All of this. Oh man, so much mess. Could I could line this place with temp shift plates? No, 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 no. Never mind. No, no, no. I don't want to do that because then I'd pull all this heat from over here. Let me actually. You know what? Now that I'm that I'm talking about it, let me do this. Is that sand regolith? Nice. Oh, bitch! Why are they running coal right now? Disable building doesn't necessarily work. Disable the buildings. I appreciate how quick they jumped on this, but now it's just like, yeah, just making heat for no reason. Yeah, so no, te no temp shift plates, because uh, I don't have anywhere to put it. Uh, I think that, uh, yeah, a liquid leak through here or something would work. Just to kind of keep a hydrogen, filling the room with hydrogen will work as well. And then just use like, um, just have the dupes just run in here and just, you know, do whatever they need to. Uh, it's not actually proposed radiators for spacecraft, or just giant panels with either water or coolant through it to radiate energy into space. But you're talking about dripping petrol. Uh, oh my god. That's a lot. Oh man. Well, the gate's gonna open. I want to see this. For sure. Any free Reese wards? Uh, you know what? Actually... I think so. It doesn't say over here. It doesn't say I have any. Wow, that's a lot of mess. So here it goes. Uh-oh. 
It's not opening. Uh, why is it not opening? Why is it not? Why is my... Come on. It's setting a red. Oh, it's not connected somewhere. Automation wire lead. Okay, so it's not must not be connected. Lead. Should be no fucking lead. Let me replace this real quick. Oh, oh I did. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're right. I did cut that. I did cut that. Thank you. It was also made out of lead. <laughs> so fuck them. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, because we gotta get that stuff down. So we, I, th I think it's probably why there's so much. We went through two cycles. Oh man, space is crazy, dude. There's so much stuff. There's just, like so much stuff to, to to manage here. Like this is a lot, and I still have the entire base to worry, worry about. Done. Gates open. Here we go. Big mess coming in. Start zapping. Zap, 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 zap. Overheat damage. Overheat damage. Made out of iron, so that was my fault. But you know what? At the very least, we have this part handled, right? Why is that? That seems weird. Um, yeah, it seems odd. Right, this okay. This 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 has to uh, change. I don't know what, where is the, where is the heat exchange here. Is there even anything in it? There's nothing in it. It's a million degrees. Uh, yeah, we'll just uh, just take it apart. Replace it with a steel one. But yeah, there's something wrong here. Uh oh. Uh, is it a comm that is over the loader? Oh, a visual bug? Yeah, that's, that's something wrong there. Damn it. Uh, what's underneath this? Nothing. Okay. Let me just destroy it. Otherwise, I have to restart the damn thing. There we go. See animation. Oh, let's get rid of that. Uh, shipping. Wow, I feel like I've spent the whole day in, in here just trying to, trying to just find my my bearing. It's crazy. No, still no steel. I'll have to go check on that in a minute. Uh, put this up one or down one. Just get out of the way. That's no, fine. Oh man, this one taking damage. I. Uh, wow, how is it getting so? Oh, maybe because the item they're picking up. Oh, duh. Of course. Oh, for fuck's sake. Now we're getting attacked again. <sighs> like I said, it's just been one thing after another. Oh, Lord. It's crazy. This is crazy. This is a nightmare. I almost wanted to say fuck it and go back and fix the base and then come back and revisit this later. I haven't even, I haven't, like, I have barely done anything on the damn base because of this nonsense. All right, well, it's dug out at least. I have no steel, I don't know why. Oh, lime. That's right. These are gonna be lime. Water, sure. Eggshell of lime. Oh, I guess we're out of eggshell. I do have a uh, fossil. I'm not using fossil for anything, so maybe we get fossil to. Um... Oh, did I miss it? Fossil to lime. There we go. Just forever and just whenever they get a chance. No natural gas over here. Oh, good thing we came down here to take a look, see? Boom, baby. Boom! Who's that? Oh, hey! These numbers are getting high enough that coming up with something clever is too hard. Kittens, sir, thank you so much for, obviously, the support and... For being such, such a lovable mod. I don't think anybody, I don't think there's, there's, I don't think anybody is as liked as a mod as you are. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. <laughs> Favorite mod, right? Right, guys? Right? 
And I mean, and, you know, Tanner's too. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, so none of these are connected. I, I forgot I didn't uh, come back here and finish the job here. Lack. Oh, I guess there's always a lack, I suppose. She's a favorite. She's a fan favorite, I think. And then... There. And it's a fucking mess. All right, so we're uh, we're out of we're out from uh, bay number one uh, because this is dormant and this is probably dormant. Twenty one seven point one cycles, six point eight cycles. So we're gonna get this back soon. Oh my god, tomorrow's Valentine's Day? Oh shit, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. <gasps> I didn't even think about that. Well, I mean, so, first off, Jen doesn't, like, do anything for Valentine's Day. So, like, we didn't even talk about it, really, until, like, yesterday, I think. She was like, you don't want to do anything for Valentine's Day, right? And I was like, I didn't say anything because you never want to do anything. And I was like, cool. Uh, but, um... Oops. But yeah, I don't know if, I, if she's gonna have a change of heart tomorrow, want to do something, or what. So, let's just say, news tomorrow! Asterisk. <laughs> Mike needs to buy a present now. Ha <laughs> ha! Hurry! They don't fear a likable mod. Oh. Mods can earn my vote by panning era. Uh, let's see. Water. So we have a good amount of water. And, like, basically, yeah, wow. Like, it's getting cool, which is nice. God, can you tell I just want to walk away from space and just be like, fuck you. Look at this. Look at this. You know why? It's because it just constantly... Anytime it, it gets hot, it just keeps transferring that heat over. Um, it doesn't cool. There's no way to cool it. So... Yeah, I, you know, I think Clunkers is right. Like, there is a... Um, I'm gonna let this thing just be broken, by the way. And I'm gonna disable this, too. I think what I'm gonna do for right now, and for the... just. Just for a bit, I'm gonna stop with the space stuff. Um, like, I, I am just floundering here. I truly am. Like, I have, you know, I have a great system for getting oxygen into this thing. But because there's no way for these buildings to cool, they're just constantly building up heat. Like, look at this thing. This thing's 540. Is this thing made of steel? It is. Yeah, and it's melted. This is 540.2 degrees. Oh, you're gonna detect anyways? You're not gonna... Oh, okay, as long as you just disable it. Just, uh... The doors are closed. It's fine. Um, but yeah, it's 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 a. Uh, I need more everything. I need more resources. I need more. We need to save auto repair for this too. Uh, yeah, anytime there's any kind of element, like actual physical object object transfer, it's also transferring that heat, and that's a problem, right? Because these things can't cool off. So, like, this thing picks something up. Look at it. It picks something. It's working, first of all, so it's generating heat. It's 463 degrees. Yeah. And these things, you know, they're not really generating heat. I mean, they're, they're working. I guess technically they're working, so maybe that's what it is. Um, but they're also storing. You see the storing uh, variable there. So they also they're also storing some, an object that's hot. So they're, they're carrying over some of that heat. They're retaining some of that heat. But this thing's going to eventually melt. Man. I was so, I was so, like, I was, I was so into, like, let's get to space, let's get to space. And now that I'm, I'm in space, it's like, dude, like, this is insane. This, this is about to overheat, actually, right now. Let's let it, let's let it, uh, finish sorting things, and once it's, uh, once it's cleaned up, then, um, we'll kill it. But, <laughs> I can see already, it's, it's not gonna make it. It's gonna melt before it gets there. What was it cooling the point? 527. 527. And here it is. Damage overheating. Although I feel like it's not really picking up anything. It's not picking up shit. And now it's done. Okay. So, hmm. Yeah, I think uh, I think we're gonna abandon space for right now. 
because I need to do some research just on my own. I just need to sit there and just kind of I can't watch any Brothgar videos because those fuckers stole his account. Um, we'll have to find somebody else. I don't, even, I don't even know any other. He's the only, uh, well, I've come across other people making Oxygen Included content, but I think, I think I'm think i probably going to have to sandbox it too, actually. That'll probably be something I have to do. But for right now, we are locking this door and we ain't going to space no more. Not for the foreseeable future. Hello, Lacey. Oh, man. God, she, she didn't... She was like chased off the internet for just being a conservative or something. Man, what a mess that was. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and lock the door. Nobody else goes in and out. That's it. We're done with space for the time being. Just done. Just done. There's tons of resources up here though, which sucks. Because I wonder once that door is locked, where our granite... Whoa, 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 hold on a second. Before they lock it. Raw mineral granite. 65.8 tons. Let's see what that number goes to. Oh, I have 65.8 tons with the door closed? Get the fuck out. Wow. For reals? Hold on a second. Let's get somebody up here to... Oh, I guess it still counts it. Usually when they don't have access to an area... Oh, wait, wait, hold on. It still says 65.8 tons. Okay. I'm certain that there's, there is some out here. Oh, maybe not. Granite. Oh, yeah. There's granite out here. Huh. How weird. Oh, oh here it is. 134. Wow. So I do have 65.8 tons in the base still. Okay. Cool. <laughs> All right. Stepping away from space for a minute. Let's, let's go over. Let's go over the main base here. Uh, I want to make sure that this stuff, and this stuff's running great, beautifully, beautifully. Uh, I feel a little defeated because I really wanted to get out there and just fuck yeah, fuck yeah, space. But, but we need to take time to further this. We'll let that rest for a minute. I'll do some research. Uh, I'll do some research so that way when I come back next, uh, we'll be able to um, uh, tackle space the right way, because right now it's just not working. I like the idea that there's a mod that lets it slowly radiate heat into space. Uh, I think that's, um, I, I, depending on how quickly it does it, I feel like that's pretty fair. Uh, but it really just depends on, you know, what, you know, what, uh, how quickly it is, it happens and, and all that. But people are are tackling space with, yeah, exactly, Jero, like, um, I, people are tackling space without using mods, so I don't necessarily feel like that's a, that's something that I should that I should really worry about. Uh, hey, what up, Omni? So, heat, yeah, wow. Like we were we were doing great. I mean, the whole base is swell. <laughs> like we are super in here, man. Look at that. Natural gas generators are chilling at 120 something degrees, and they are not going anywhere. They've been running like that forever. Um, the base is eh, it's a little 99 degrees down here. It's a little warm. I wonder why it's so warm down here. Oh, it's because there's not enough oxygen cy uh, cycling out. That's all. Let me see. That comes in and that goes. Yeah. We're generating a ton of hydrogen, though. I wish there was a way to see the hydrogen count. Is there a way to see that? I would like to see how much hydrogen I have. Just kind of like ambient hydrogen. Gotta be careful, guys. We got... Uh... Oh, we have lots of natural gas kind of floating around, so... Never mind. We're gonna... We'll be fine. It's a resources. resources. Lime. Well, we do have lime over here being made. Blowing up my circuits. There we go. Line. And that comes down here. And it's gonna get made. I hate that it's, I, I really hate that it's like this that's bubbling over. <laughs> it's just like aesthetically, it looks terrible. Uh, yeah, we'll have these guys continue to fill this thing up petroleum. Maybe we'll get the, the, the polymer press going. Just let that thing run forever. Just make sure we still have like infinite plastic because we're like never going to, uh, um, Build a storage for it, I guess. <laughs> Infinite. Wait, what's it made out of? Gold amalgam. Oh, I could I could still make it out of steel if I want to make it last longer. If for some reason it doesn't. Um, I put some examples in a sandbox. Has like, yeah, I, I think I'm gonna do a sandbox and then then just kind of like you know go do my best to explain how he transits work. No, I I could I could figure that part out. Uh, I just need to do it right. You know, I. I 
I, I have a good understanding. It's just adapting to how the game operates. Um, that's what I need to do. So, uh, like how how it handles heat transfer. Because I mean, you know, there there clearly was no heat transfer with items that are sitting on top of each other. But there is heat transfers when in terms of like you know this on top of this. Um, but there is heat transfer whenever something is buried under something. So I got to figure out a better way to uh, to do that. I you know it's funny. I think it was was a poppy who was or poppy or top. Somebody said. Um, Oh, incoming, uh, or, or here, he's here in a while, I'm gonna revert and just actually do the rock crushing setup, right? And you know what, man? Like, that's looking pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Like, that, this regolith bullshit, because not only, not only is it, yeah, probably two hours later, exactly. Not only is it, you know, burying my stuff and causing a lot of heat issues, but also, I have to store it somewhere, right? So it's it's getting stored. <laughs> so that's that's something that I need to uh, yeah I, I need to sandbox it. I need to 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 you know figure out how I'm gonna create a better balance. And also you know I gotta get better power. Like my power distribution up here is just absolutely horrendous. Um, you know like this setup is this was this was such a pipe dream. Like yeah let's get all this stuff set up and it'll just run just a little bit at a time. Slowly overheat. It'll take forever to overheat. Uh, or we just take it apart and excuse me and rebuild it. But that's 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 also kind of cheesy too. You need a spacer to catapult, yeah. Hide lasers above the gates, um, yeah. That'll be a good thing to do, actually. Uh, like put like another layer of bunkers right here or something, or actually no, move these bunker doors up. You create kind of like a like a Wonder Woman W, right? Kind of a Wonder Woman U, <laughs> uh, and then. Have, that way it can still have the same reach. It'll zap everything. And then when it's done, zap it'll zap as it's happening. So it shouldn't be any issues. Um, I think that's probably the best, the best solution. I'm not for anything Gal Gadot 2, man. I'm so excited for Wonder Woman uh, 1984 or whatever it's called. That shit looks so great. Okay. Uh, that's it. <laughs> I think we're good on screenshots also. Let me go ahead and grab this game. And then lower this down. Let's like lower. No, I don't want to lower too much because I won't be able to see anything. Good, good, good. I'm going save. Oh, we had to try to do a save as. So a new save is going to be 1100. Uops, no, not 1100. It's got to be <laughs> Space Bros Alpha 1100. Boy, I was lazy. Let's see. Save as. New save. Oh, God. Man. Done. Done. And then gone. So yeah, moving these things up just a little bit, putting the lasers on top, letting that do its thing there. Maybe make a little bit of room for the uh for the sweepers also operate and pull things down. That way we keep this whole area clean and nothing ever touches this. Nothing ever touches this. That's the biggest problem, is we just can't, yeah. Uh I like the idea. I do like the idea of dripping something. Uh, uh, across that, across the uh, the telescope or whatever to transfer heat, but we still have to worry about where we're going to delete that heat. Uh, petrol is perfect because uh, it's it uh, it cools and heats so quickly, and I think like I don't think it turns into a gas like ever. Uh, maybe maybe at a thousand degrees or something like that, but yeah, I don't think that dripping it across like telescope or something like that that's like really warm is gonna evaporate and turn it into a gas or anything like that i think it's just yeah um i don't know how dripping works in space well we're not we're not we're not in space space like we still have a gravitational pull because everything still rests on the ground so it's totally plausible to uh drip something across something else in space because gravity is still uh having an impact so so yeah wow man god brutal I was, yeah, fucking space. Let's do it. Oh, shake my microphone and everything. And then we get to space and it's just like, oh. <laughs> Man. Remember remember that guy back in like the 90s? Uh, who was like, he was like, yeah, I'm gonna fight Mike Tyson. And he was like, fuck yeah, I'm gonna fight Mike Tyson. And then he fought Mike Tyson and Mike Tyson like punched him like once. And he was down in like 10 seconds or something like that. You guys remember that? It was like some white guy. That's what I feel like right now. It's like, fuck yeah, space. I'm, I'm gonna get out there. I'm gonna, ah. Uh. No, not that. That was, that was Vander Holyfield. That was a different one. <laughs> Although Tyson could have totally fought this dude and then fought uh, Holyfield right after it. 